You too was goody. I'm back and it's go time. The paint just showed up. I got the paint. So I'm about to go ahead and mix that up. I already don't sculpt the car up. Don't touch up the little spots I need to touch up. It's go time, man. Oh yeah, I got the QA1 sway bar. The sway bar bushings and the sway bar links. So those just showed up. They got here the same time as the paint. So now I only got to order two more things for the front end. That's the paint. That's the sway bar. I just got to order the brake calibers and I got to get the pitment on and the front end wrapped up. So I'm about to go ahead and mix this paint up, get the spray in there so I can get this out of the way. I'll cut y'all back on in a second. You too. It's two days later, baby. It's two days later. It's been two days since I sprayed this thing. So that paint is nice and cured. She got some runs and she got some trash. But what I'm going to do... I'm going to go ahead and wet sand it and flow coat it. So I'm going to wet sand it. I'm going to put the um, pin scraping on. I got decals for the back. It's going to be smooth body. I got the Chevrolet. Then I got the Caprice Custom. It said Caprice Custom. So yeah, that's where I'm at. Definitely got some trash on. See what I can do on the wet sand, man. See what I can get done on the wet sand. Boy, she got some trash in. All right, YouTube. Your boy about to get busy. I came over here like two days ago and did this wet sand of this just to see how she'll knock down but i gotta clean in here so i'm gonna start by i'm gonna go ahead and finish wet sand of this and remove all this plastic because i can't i can't paint i'm gonna have to redo this plastic so if i um go to spraying the paint this shit gonna flake up and it'll fly up on the paint so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and rip all that off the front all that plastic. I think it's some on the front part of here too. Yeah. Spray that clear. That mess right there be going crazy. So I'm gonna have to remask that. But I'm gonna wet sand the car, remask it. I probably pull the car out. I gotta clean the hood real good before I start painting. So what I wanna do. I might, I think I'm gonna push the car, I might hit this joint with the power washer. Just get it once over, cause when I shoot these last coats of clear, I wanna be as clean as possible in here. Wet all this up real good. Yeah, get all this dirt up out of here. Hit it with the blower, probably go across it with the power washer. Boy, I got a lot of work to do. I'm about to get busy.
how to YouTube. I don't wait saying this whole side. Still got a couple spots. Now I got them. So a little bit more attention. Had a couple hot spots back there. So I ain't gonna hit that no more. It's gonna be what it's gonna be. But yeah. For the most part, she ready, man. She ready. I gotta hit this side. I'm gonna call it a day right here. I'll probably hit this side tomorrow. Get over there tomorrow. Hit this side. Hit the trunk. Hit the hood. And it's go time. I ain't gonna do too much talking. Don't be hell, man. Don't be hell. I'm telling y'all what I know, man. I'm telling y'all what I know. gonna be hell yes sir but I'll cut y'all back on when I start back getting busy it'll be tomorrow about to go ahead and wrap it up right here cut y'all back on tomorrow alright YouTube I'm gonna pick up where I left off at the other day I came yesterday I already don't start sending this trunk when I got half of it done I'm gonna go ahead and pick up where I left off finish getting busy yes sir I should be able to get this thing all the way sanded today. I was gonna pull it out front. But they over here at the neighbor house cutting down a tree. Damn, that's a big tree. Why he getting rid of all the shade? That tree is huge, man. He getting rid of all that good shade. I guess he'd rather got to save his house. But yeah. Finish getting to it. The boys out here get busy. Look at that crane, dog. That crane, huge. Finish sanding that thing. I'm gonna go ahead and put the sway bar and sway bar links on that today. Set the time lapse up. Finish getting busy, baby.
in and set the hood and the front clip. I'm gonna come back and hit those tomorrow. But everything nice and smooth. Got a few little spots I can touch up. Try to knock down some more. For the most part, she's smooth. I cut y'all back on when I'm finishing up. Go time. All right, YouTube finally got finished doing the wet sanding. I just rinsed the whole car. I'm gonna um, I'm about to take that front plastic down. And I'm gonna push the box out there. And I'm gonna power wash this in here. Power wash this, I'll probably spray the box off again. Make sure she real clean. Pull it back in and get busy. Put the pin stripes on, then it's time to clear. Pin stripes, I got decals that's gonna go on the back. Then all I gotta do is flow coat it. Go time, huh? All the wet sanding is complete. About to power wash this dry away right quick to make sure it's nice and clean in here. Got a few more spots I might touch up with fish on right there. But for the most part, the wet sand is complete. We'll go ahead and tighten this door up. Look at these eye rocks I bought yesterday. I got these joints yesterday. $200. I think I'm gonna slap him on the Chevy. That's for the time being. We'll get some new tires put on these things. But yeah, I'm about to pull it out, power wash the driveway, and get the applying them on pin scrapes and decals. I'll cut y'all back on. thing out in the sun look at that panoramic on that thing boy Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man. Some pretty work, boy. Some pretty work. Cut y'all back on.
clean up under here. Got it nice and clean up under here. Yes, sir. Now, I'm gonna clean the box up. Before I push her back in, huh? I'm gonna give her a nice little, nice little wipe down. Give her a nice little wipe down. Oh, plastic. Hold on now. Hold on now. tame on that plastic but yeah I'm gonna go ahead and um clean the box clean the box up real good before I push it back in now yeah that's where we at cut y'all back on so I don't be knowing what I'm recording but y'all gotta I be looking elsewhere coming together though. I already put all my glass in. Ready to put all my glass in. The mission is go ahead and get the um, pin stripes on it, the decals, flow coated. Then I can start putting my glass back in it. First one probably go in, put that back window in. Kind of make sure that's in before I get the top done. I probably leave the sunroof out until they finish. I want them to make the headliner too, so I'm gonna call them and ask them, do I need to put the sunroof in or do should I leave it out? They'll probably tell me to leave it out. But yeah, go time, man. Huh? Let me cut this thing off and get busy, huh? That baby nice and cleaned up. Now I'm about to go ahead and push it back in there. Let the car let this ground dry a little bit. But yeah, it was dirt tracked all through here. Damn paint and dust from me sanding all through here. So yeah. And y'all tell me this color ain't hell, dog. Y'all tell me this color is not hell. And I got the all the trimming, the bumpers, everything at the bottom black. I got the black pin striper for. Her. Tell me this bitch ain't gonna be hell, nigga. Tell me. Go ahead and see it. And I'm gonna get the gray top. Get the gray rag put on it to match the gray accent. Man, tell me this bitch ain't gonna be hell, yo. And this is where I built it at. Right here at Aunt House. Like I said, on the real MVP. Got that moon, that panoramic, that moon roof on that bitch. Tell me the boss ain't gonna be here. And she gonna be done like 90% by me. Only thing I'm not gonna do is reupholster the seats. I'm gonna take that and get them done. Pay somebody to do the top. Pay somebody to do the headliner. Everything else, me. And pay somebody to rebuild the transmission. 
I'm gonna rebuild the engine myself. Me, hundred, damn near hundred percent. Tear machine bad. Gotta stop playing with some rain. Let me go ahead and push it in. Get ready to apply these decals and these pin scraper. Show y'all what I got playing. All right, two. I don't got this thing pushed back in. We got it nice and wiped down. Got some goodies. That's what I'm putting up there, Caprice Custom. Caprice Custom. Got the Chevrolet. I got made multiple ones. I think this the this the right Chevrolet to go up there. I just made multiples just in case I mess up. And then on the end of the pen scraper, I got the black pen scraper. Yeah, that would have been about the size. So instead of using these little things right here, I'm gonna put one of these Capri symbols at the back. At the end of each pen scraper. So it look like it'll fit right there perfect. And then I'm gonna put one on the other end, just like it. I made these too. Well, my lady on, um, she printed them out on the Cricut. She found all the um, all the ones I needed, printed them out. I put them on a the transfer tape. That's the bit Caprice jump. I'm gonna put that on the back window. Y'all need some of these, y'all let me know too, cause I can print them up and nicely sell them to you. I made a lot of these because I'm gonna, um, like I said, I'm gonna put one on each joint and then I'm gonna put one on each door handle. So yeah, it's my little custom junk I got going on. I'm not gonna use that though, I'm gonna use these. And then I'm gonna put four of these on the door handles. Come and paint the door handles that same silver. There's that down there. This was a um this one we messed up, but I think I'm gonna put it like at the top of a window. So yeah, I think I got yeah, I got a lot of them, so just to figure out, just in case I messed up, but you know, Caprice Custom, baby, she ain't a classic no more. It's a um, 2022 Caprice Custom. Let me um, get everything. I got to get me some cloth so I can finish drying this car off. Get everything right. I got to wipe it down with some prep oil. Make sure everything right. And I'll cut y'all back on before I start applying the decals in the pen scrape. I know I got the camera in the worst place possible, but. All right, so I got it off. It's on the transfer tape. Yes, sir. The V a little cricket. It's all good to me, though. It look good for the eyeball. Good enough for me. Now, I gotta do the same thing. I'm gonna cut y'all back off. Cut y'all back on. Let me get this off of that thick ass paper. Priest custom for the other side.
outside. Going pretty smooth. You two, we came to a unanimous decision to redo this one over here. Because the V was crooked, so I'm gonna um, peel these off and get the other one ready to go and I'll cut y'all back on. You two, I got the Chevrolet. I, I, mean, I thought I was recording. I don't know how long the camera been on. But yeah, Chevrolet. Caprice Custom. Now what I'm about to do is figure out where I'm going to put these at. I think I'm going to put one on the end right here. And then I'm going to put another one up here. Come right off the end of the pen scrape. I think that's going to be hard. So I'm about to wipe everything down with wax and grease remover and get the landy pen scrapes. Then I'll put these on at the end. Alright, I'm going to start laying the pen scraping. Trying to make sure I get it right. So I feel like I need to bring it up some more. It looks like it's a little lower right here. All right there. Try to get that thing as straight as possible. So she got a little waviness right there. I don't know you two what y'all think, man. All right, look to y'all. Look good to me. I just want to make sure it's good, good, because I'm I'm putting clear coat over this, so I want to make sure it's good enough. So I don't have to fuck with it in the future. But yeah, they look good. Yeah. Pretty decent. She looking pretty decent. Okay. Okay. How much time I got left? Now I need to have a camera in a better spot, like up here.
That look pretty decent. It just seems a little uneven right here in this area. Like from right here to right there. So I just needed to come down a little bit. Right around that area is bothering me though. I feel like it can come down a little lower. Just seem like it's too high right, it's right there. The rest of it don't get in the line up perfect. Perfect for me. Let me go ahead and finish. Cut y'all back on. All right, YouTube, I got one arm up there. I like that. What I probably should have did was line that up with the top line though. Line that right there up, straight with the top line. But I like the way that came out. I wanted to get one up there to show y'all right quick. It's getting dark. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and finish it up. It's the finishing touches I gotta do. And then I hit it with the flow coat. Cut y'all back on. Man, she gonna be hell now. All right, YouTube, got all the pin striping done. Got my decals on. Now all that's left to do is flow coat this thing, baby. I gotta mask everything up and flow coat it. Well, yeah, Chevrolet up there, Caprice Custom. Got the Chevy symbols right at the end of the pin striping. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man, it's go time. I got some silver pen scrapping at the house, too. It would have been nice if they could would have made them two-tone. Black, the thick one, black, and the top skinny one, silver. That would have been five. Black at the bottom, because everything, all the chrome trim that was on the bottom, it's painted black. And then silver at the top. Cause all the silver, all the trim that's gonna be around the windows and shit is gonna be silver. That would have been fire. Just little stuff like that, man. Little stuff like that. Little, little details, man. I love little details like that. But I do got the um I do got a silver pen scraping at the house. And I could have probably ran this black one and then ran the silver one right on top of it. It would have been extra work, but that shit would have been fire. Stuff for the next build, or if I ever repaint it, you know. But I'm gonna call it a day right here. I ain't gonna cut the camera back on until the car masked up and is ready to spray. Cut y'all back on tomorrow. coating that thing oh this looks phenomenal this looks for boy boy this looks amazing man I put like four coats up here this looks amazing
This looks amazing. I can't wait to pull it back out in the sun. I'm gonna have to let it sit right here for a couple days though. This looks amazing. Yes, sir. I am satisfied. I am satisfied. This looks amazing. I really like how I did that. Put that right there on the internet pin striper. That is nice. This looks amazing. Well, y'all like, share, comment, subscribe. Tell me what, get in that comment section and tell me what y'all thinking, yo. I'm gonna end the video off right here. But the next video, when I turn that camera on, she gonna have all the bumpers on. I'm talking about all the bumpers. She gonna have the bumpers and all the trim on. Yes, sir. Hit that like button. Hit that comment section, tell me what y'all think, yo. I feel good about it. Y'all know on that next video, when she, she gonna be sitting right out front in the sun, bumpers on, tr black trim on, so we can see how it hit with that black pin stripe. Man. I'm satisfied with it. I'm satisfied with it. Even a little piece I got hanging up over here, I got her stupid with. Yes, sir. Man. Yeah, I'm happy. You too. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one, baby. Stay locked in, boy. Coming. Summer rain coming. She ain't going to play no game. She is not coming to play no game. Man. All right, I'm out.